bag here. And um, I'm sort of demonstrating with my very poor work guitar ability, okay, our latest creation, uh, which is this, um, possibly the world's smallest guitar combo that works off batteries and is all valve. Um, so anyway, um, sorry about my not particularly good guitar playing, but this is a, a, a transparent uh, front panel, okay? And inside you can see the valves. So the thing about the DL series of valves is they don't actually light up when they're working. They don't. The reason why is because the heater dissipation is extremely low. So anyway, what we've got, we've got a volume control there, we've got an on-off switch and a tone control, which does have some effect. So anyway, here we are. You switch the thing on and it lights up inside. We like like things maxed out, so anyway, here we go. Turn it to the level. to be said about it is that's um, a speaker output for extension 8 ohms 8 ohm speaker like you could plug it into <coughs> let's say Marshall 4x12 box and um, a cabinet opens up like this those are LEDs inside that, in, that um, what do they do they illuminate the inside they light up they light up right, there you go. Isn't it? so we've got like there's the uh, <clears throat> three valves that's uh daf 91 daf 91 dl 96 uh that's the output transformer you need not to touch that if you know you get a, a little bit of a shock not that much it's only 90 volts a tingle right so this is the actual battery compartment you've got 10 of those little jobbies they're um smoke alarm batteries easy available they cost me a pound eight, uh, for two so the whole thing can be re-battered for a fiver. a fiver, which is not too bad at all if you think about it. And you've got a little one and a half volt D cell there, and um, there's all the bits inside. <laughs> Turn this way. Uh, and that. So let's pop this back. Which way? Like that. Yeah. 
There you go. Give it the twirl. Give it the twirl. There's little LEDs up there, see. So, so, so the well, the thing is, the little valves they, they like to have a little bit of light in there so they know what they're doing. You see, that's why they get a bit confused. And they say, How do you expect me to amplify a signal if I can't see? They're scared of the dark, anyway. they're scared of the dark, exactly. <laughs> yes. Well, you know, I mean, think about it, those valves are what 19, 1950s, you know, so they, they are getting on a bit. So yeah, it's a bit like you, a isn't it? <laughs> Oh yeah, a little bit worried. You know, 1955 I was born, did. Mm. And these valves come from the same era as when I was when hatched. I was hatched. <laughs> so there you mm. are. That was big. <laughs> This guitar is a bit strange as well because it's one of those with the built in amplifier. It kind of works when it feels like it, sort of by pig nose. Oh, well, it's decided not to work. There we are, yeah. So, because it's such a small amp. And the speaker is near the string, so you know, I think I think Pig knows they didn't quite get it wrong because it does work. So what I added myself was this little potentiometer, okay, which um which is power soak, zero. And what happens? There you go. Feedback, so it kinda of, it kinda of works, but I don't know if they got that one wrong, but... Mm. Nothing you do about that. The moment you let the strings go, it starts feeding back. Never mind, never mind, never mind. Never mind. And that... Whoops, wrong hole. <laughs> Said the actress to the bishop. <laughs> right, there we go. Let's try this again. Yeah. 
interesting sound, a difference between um, valves and transistors, the way they sound. Thank you, Shrub. That's lovely. Okay. The Bye, thing is, folks. We can, we can YouTube it. Bye, folks. God, it's so cold. <laughs>